Gucci, and today I'm gonna make one of my favorite snacks, afternoon pick-me-up, avocado toast with gluten-free bread from Erwan in LA. So I toasted the bread, drizzle some olive oil. Everything is better with olive oil. So I also like the avocado to be a bit firmer. I tend to buy organic food. I really am not a fan of the pesticides and I don't want my kids to have pesticides on my husband. I don't like to add too much avocado because then it can get kind of too squishy and dominant. I can also add Parmesan sometimes, which is nice, but I'm not really feeling the dairy currently, so. So, so far I'm here. Add some crunch in with some radish and some poblano pepper. And I like everything to be kind of spicy. My love of spice definitely has something to do with having really good Mexican food when I was younger. I do really love cooking. I find it really soothing. I'm not great at following recipes, but I think it's such a nice pastime. I'm gonna sprinkle some of the poblanos. Now I'm gonna cut a little bit of a radish. My brother Nick is actually a trained cook. So he's a very welcome house guest. My flat leaf Italian parsley. And I'm gonna squeeze in a bit of lime juice. And again to sea salt. A pinch. Avocado without salt is really not my favorite. Oof, super bland. Some pressure pepper. So this is my gluten-free avocado toast recipe with radish, flat leaf parsley, red poblano pepper, olive oil, key, crushed red pepper, coarse sea salt. And that's it. Mm. Thank you.